McDonald's. You love it, you hate it, it's probably one of, if not, the most well-known fast food chain in the world, and on another note, Disney. People also love M or hate M, and yet they're also a massive name in the animated film industry as a whole alongside some other things they made. Although these two have collaborated before usually via new toys in their Happy Meals, McDonald's have never made a special meal based off of their mascot, usually only making meals based off of celebrities. Why do I mention these two brands you may ask? Well, I'll be talking about a little incident that occurred a while ago, which was meant to ruin the reputations of both of these iconic companies for no reason at all. In 2013, on the month of August, a fake advertisement showcasing a supposed new meal, named the Mickey Mouse Meal, surfaced on the internet. The meal consisted of a Big Mac with Mickey-shaped patties, a 10-piece chicken nuggets box with nuggets that were also Mickey-shaped, a medium fry box, and a strawberry banana smoothie. The uploader claimed that this commercial aired in 2010, with said meal not being sold anymore in any location. Suspiciously three hours after its upload, a whole bunch of eBay listings popped up, which claimed to be selling an opened versions of the aforementioned meal. With all the interest around the video, people were quick to buy the meal to have a taste of it for themselves, with excitement expressed upon the arrival of the meals. However, what eventually happened a few minutes later would unfold a series of disturbing events. People reported that their meals were not as shown in the advertisement, and didn't have good tastes either, as the burgers tasted like rotten meat covered in feces, the nuggets having perfectly intact bones in them, the fries having strange metal objects in them, and the smoothies having an unpleasant NyQuil-esque flavor. This caused some who were injured and or upset by the meal to wrongly sue McDonald's for a false practice of exploiting a beloved character to sell a meal to harm others. A day after this, authorities got involved with the incident and investigated various McDonald's areas for suspected food poisoning involving the meal, however, evidence proving that the meal existed and was made by the brand wasn't found, nor did the workers at the places remember making a Mickey Mouse meal. However, the real culprits would not be found until three days later. The people behind the incident were none other than a group of five individuals who worked together in order to make the false meals. They used dead rats and grinded them up in order to make the patties, put chicken leg bones into the meat of the nuggets, get needles inside the french fries, and mixed NyQuil and some bananas in order to make the smoothie. One of the members used CGI and 3D animation in order to make the commercial seem more realistic to the oblivious eye. The perpetrators were soon arrested for attempted murder via tampering with food and faking evidence. Despite this situation being aging for its time as well as more measures being made to make sure incidents like this don't happen again, we can all learn one message. Don't believe what you see on the internet, who knows if it's fake.